Hey folks, it's Bob from Curly Woodwind again, and today I wanted to show you this uh, little saxophone here. It's a Selma Mark VI. It is from 1963, and um, in silver plate, as you can see, in pretty good shape. Um, let's have a look at it so you can see what's going on. There we go. Quite a lot of plating intact. I'd probably say about 95%, maybe a bit more. Um, there we go. So yeah, in pretty good shape. Um, there's a few little, tiny little knocks here, there and everywhere kind of thing as you'd expect for something this age. Um, Bow's in pretty good shape again. Um, obviously all original silver plate. Um, you can see that it is a high of sharp model as well, so it comes with that feature. Okay, and yeah, all original pearls, pads are in good shape, just being serviced today. Um, and there you go. Right, so the first thing to, I'm sure most of you know about Mark Sixes, uh, first thing to talk about is the next. The original neck is no longer with us. <clears throat> We're not too sure what happened to it, but we haven't got it. Um, this has been played by the same player, um, a professional player who's retired recently uh, for some 30 odd years, and um, he never had the neck either. So what we have is a Super Action 80 neck on it, as you can see, okay, from early 80s, 1980s, which plays very, very well. And um, to be honest with you, plays very, very similarly to most of the Mark's six necks that I've ever played. Very, very similar shape. Um, a little bit more Mark 60, shall we say, than uh, the Super Action 80 Series 2 necks, which seems to be a little bit different. But the bonus um, is this as well. It comes with a, I think it's an early 50s, uh, late 40s, um, super balanced action neck. Um, which is kind of quite a different taper on it. It has got a little, little tiny thing there and corresponded on that side as well. Um, but it plays so well with it, I don't want to start trying to take those dents or anything out. Um, they're only little tiny ones as you can see. Very different taper to the other neck. Um, and the beauty of this is you have um, a very well set up Mark VI which plays incredibly quick. Um, very, very accurate, uh, tuning is absolutely spot on, but you have two necks um, and this one is going to give you more of a traditional Mark VI Selma uh, bright lead alto kind of sound and then you can switch to this super balanced action neck uh, which really opens up the sound, uh, much bigger, uh, much broader kind of sounding and takes off a bit of the highs, not quite as punchy. Um, almost gives you that kind of, uh, I don't know whether you know what I mean, when you get that alto in it sounds almost a bit like a tenor and this kind of neck does it, I really like this neck. Um, but this one would be great for doing typical alto playing. Um, so that's it basically, it's uh, available for sale now. Um, it is a really, really good super little saxophone. Um, as I say, it is a professional instrument, it has been owned by a professional player. Um, it is not showroom condition. Um, we'll. Uh, I have more photos on the website uh, that you can have a peruse of. Um, but playing wise, it plays absolutely fantastic. It is uh, literally a player's horn. Um, and whoever decides to go for it, it's going to be uh, owner of a very, very nice saxophone indeed. Uh, it's one of the nicest playing altos that we've had through the shop in um, certainly a couple of years. So um, let's have a listen to what it sounds like. Thank you. 